Well, Tubers, I was going to do this enormous production on um, on this, and I was going to have time lapses and everything else, and I did a whole heap of recording, and the 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 electrician didn't want to be on camera at all. So basically, it's not done. Look, it's not finished. It's not buttoned up. But f me, I'm happy. So that charge is doing 17 amps. Drawing a little bit from the batteries. And the inverter is doing 18 amps. It is running. It is up and running. It is all done. It is configured. I got a power point here now with a safety switch. So I got a safety switch inside my shed, which is awesome. I've still got to do all the covers and stuff like that. But I haven't got the computer hooked up. I'm going to go and buy a NUC for that now. Battery voltage is at 28.4 volts, which is 28.8 volts is what I've got it set at. So, and as you can see with that, it's just running off batteries. Uh, the house is using 430 watts. So we got the inputs, so that's 240 volts, and that's output is because we're on battery. So, oh my god, I'm happy. Now I've got a bunch of stuff still left to do. The cables, I've got an enormous amount of cabling. It's just all laying on the ground because the 12, uh, 24 volt I can do myself. It's got to go through those two holes up the top and I've got to do some conduit. And then it's going to come through the top here. And then come down and around so it all looks pretty so it's running my whole house is running off recycled laptop batteries not my whole house it is not my whole house it is just the power sockets and the lights and fans the hot water system the electric stove and all the air conditioners are not running from these batteries so it's not my whole house but you know my whole house oh my god I'm so happy I keep checking these meters backwards and forwards, in and out, because I'm just, ah, uh, the Sparky's just left and he did the same thing. And he's a subscriber too, and oh, far out. It's pretty bloody cool, really. The batteries are fully charged, so 28.8 volts. Um, the MPPT is throttling, so uh, it should be around about 80 is watts coming in from the panels, and it goes up as it throttles it, so. That's awesome. Batteries are charged, so they're not putting anything in the batteries. I don't know what else to show you. I've got to, got to run all. Ah, that's not good. That's some make good, some good editing. Um, I still got to run all the cables. I need that cable going through those holes to the other shed, and I need the the data line for this going to the other shed. Uh, I still have to put that con the conduit and the Cat Five cable. I'm gonna to have to dig that in and, and, and put that around. The NUC is gonna go behind there. So hopefully from back here, apart from a few cables and a power board, that's all you're gonna see. You're not gonna see very much stuff there at all, which is gonna be awesome. Uh, in future, I might actually put in a, like a 12 volt power source, maybe a USB charging station or something like that as well. That'd be pretty cool if I could do that. So YouTube, Sorry this isn't some sort of massive production on how awesome it was, but look, it doesn't take away from the fact that it's running. And have I said I'm happy? I think I have covered that. I really have covered that. Ah, oh, 15 amps, for that's awesome. Anyway, YouTube, I'm gonna leave it here for now. Um, I still have the BMS's to get for that, but that's going to be a little bit of time, I think, just because of the old, um, this stuff. If you like what I do, like, rate, and, uh, I don't ask for too much, but could you share it? I'm so proud of it. If you can share it on social media or wherever else, uh, that means more than giving me a hundred bucks. Get it out there, and, um, hopefully I do make a little bit extra YouTube income, and I can grab those, um individual balances sooner thanks guys